Welcome to the Speedmaster video manual. Positioned on the side of the watch is the crown, which is used for setting the time and adjusting the time zone and the date. Although the watch is self-winding, when the crown is in this position, it can be wound forward for extra power. To set the time, pull the crown out two clicks to its furthest position. The seconds hand will stop. Turn the crown forward or backward to move the hour and minute hands to the desired time. You can adjust the time zone easily to accommodate time changes when you travel. Pull the crown to position 2 and turn it forward or backward to move the hour hand. This won't affect the position of the running minute and seconds hands. To adjust the date forward, advance the hour hand past midnight. To adjust the date backward, move the hour hand back past 7 p.m. to ensure it changes. When the settings are completed, make sure the crown is in position 1. The chronograph is used for measuring time periods of up to 12 hours. To start or stop timing, press the upper pusher located at 2 o'clock. The Omega Coaxial Caliber 9300 has 12 hour and 60 minute chronograph hands placed on the same counter at 3 o'clock. This combined hour and minute counter can also be used as a second time zone indication. Simply start the chronograph at midnight or noon in the other time zone. To reset the chronograph hands, press the lower pusher located at 4 o'clock. For ease of reading in low light conditions, the watch's hands and applied indexes are coated with superluminova which emits a green light. The average speed of a moving object can be measured with your Speedmaster by using the central chronograph hand in conjunction with the watch's tachymetric scale. For example, the speed of a car can be measured over a set distance of 1 km. Press the upper pusher located at 2 o'clock to start the measurement. When the car has reached a distance of 1 km, press the pusher again to stop the measurement and read the value on the bezel scale. In our case, the car has covered the distance in 30 seconds. Therefore, it's traveling at an average speed of 120 km per hour. Thank you for watching this video manual. We hope you enjoy your Speedmaster.